Hey everyone, welcome to Linux Fam. Back with another Linux desktop customization video. And today we'll show how to customize your Fedora desktop using Hyperland. You've already seen the end results and we hope you liked it. So let's start this customization. First download the project file. You can find the link of the project file down in the description of this video. Once you extract it, you will find a text file called downloads link. Open it and simply copy paste the themes links into your browser and then simply download the themes and icons pack. After you have downloaded all the themes, extract them one by one, and then open a new window. Inside your home directory, select Show Hidden Files, and then right-click on an empty space and create a new folder called .icons. And create another folder called .themes. And after that, simply move the downloaded icon packs to .icons folder. And then do the same for the GTK themes folders as well. Simply drag and drop inside the .themes folder. Now inside the project file, you'll find a script called everything.sh. We just need to run the script and it will do all the job for us. So for that, open a terminal and go to your project file. You can type ls to check which directory you're in right now. And to change directory, you type cd and then the name of the folder you want to be in. Then simply make the script executable by typing chmod plus x and then the name of the script, which is everything.sh. And finally run the script by typing dot slash everything.sh and press enter and type password. And then it will start installing all the packages for us, which will need to customize the desktop. This will make the work easier for us, which would take hundreds of hours to figure out which packages to install. This script would do everything. Now, after it has finished its work, simply press Control C on your keyboard and close the terminal and then restart your computer. Now at the login screen, select your username and click on the gear icon and select Hyperland and type your password and login. Now we're in Hyperland. Here, press F3 on your keyboard to bring up the file explorer. We'll simply make the Nemo file explorer minimal looking. So hide the status bar and toolbar and make the icons bigger by pressing Control and the plus key on your keyboard and press F9 to hide the side panel. Now we'll install the fish shell. So for that, open a terminal by pressing the function F2 key on your keyboard and go to the project file and run the install fish.sh script and then reboot. So to reboot, you can press F6 on your keyboard to bring up the reboot logout and power off buttons, or you can press the button itself, which is at the top right corner of the screen. All right, guys, everything is done. You can bring up the theme switcher by pressing F4 on your keyboard or there's a button in the left top corner with the pencil icon. You can switch between three themes, warm, cold, and light. And you can press the F7 button on your keyboard to apply a different wallpaper. And press F8 on your keyboard to bring up the taskbar. Or simply press F8 button to hide the taskbar. Hope you liked this customization. And thank you so much for the support. We'll see you soon in the next video.